Hi guys! So today I'm going to show you guys how you can make a fish with this mango. So it's kind of like a fruit art and you guys know that I love to do those. Um, I recently just posted a picture of this mango fish uh, fruit art on my Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter and a lot of you guys really liked it. And it's very simple to do so I thought maybe this morning I could just show you guys how to do that. Um, so for that, you, all you need is a mango, one full mango and um, you could use some dried cranberries, raisin, or any other dark dried fruit for the eyes of the fish. Um, and for the seaweed, I'm going to use cucumbers and you guys can use like celery or any other things that you know you have around for that. So this is the last mango I have. I gotta make sure I don't ruin this so please pray for me. Alright, so let's get started. Okay, so I'm just going to take my knife and just how you usually cut the mango, um, that's how I'm going to cut it. So I'm just going to take my knife, just stick that in. Alright, there's my first half. And I'm just going to do the other side. Alright, here's a cleaner half. So this piece you don't really need. So I'm just going to keep that on the side. Alright, so this is going to be one of our fish. And I'm going to use the more, you know, the more uh, curvier part for the face. So let me just cut it first. Cut it out like that. And then for the body, this is the head, and for the body, I'm going to cut it my first half. But I'm not going to just cut the piece out. I'm just going to so it's still attached there. So that's my first piece. Second, and I usually do four, depending on how long the mango is. Um, I think I can do four in this one too. So there, I'm gonna cut the last piece off. And this is gonna be the tail. Sit right down the middle so it's easier to eat and it kinda looks like the scales of the fish. So there it is. And just to make the head look more stable, I'm gonna just cut a little piece off. All right, so there, the head is more stable now. Okay, so I've got the tail, and for the tail, all I'm gonna do is just slice it right down in the middle like that. And I'm just gonna put it like this. I'm gonna make him look really cute and give him a little smile. So just like that. There you go. And let me have the fish facing this way. And then the other one can face the other way. So now I'm going to do the seaweed part. So I'm going to take my first cucumber and I'm just going to slice it. Slice it on the corner like that. And then like that. So it just looks like a little grass, like a seaweed. And it's edible. Alright, here's this one. And this one needs to be a little more sharper at the top. Mmm, I love the smell of fresh cucumber. Alright, so finally for the eyes, I'm just going to use a small tiny cranberry dried cranberry and I'm just gonna try to cut it in a little tiny circle I'm just gonna just press it lightly on the fish and there's my second eye and that's how you make a fish with a mango so if you guys want you can also add some lemon on top um, some chili powder and some salt. That's how I like my mangoes. So yeah, you can do this to entertain your guests or um, You can just you know surprise your loved ones. It's really easy to do. It doesn't take too much time So yeah, I have a lot of different ideas for simple fruit food arts So if you guys want to see more don't forget to like this video and um, Yeah, that's all for today and I'll catch you guys later. Take care and bye-bye